by the end of this lesson, you should be able to activate a new SAP Analytics Cloud account, access an SAC tenant and best practices for tenant access, customize your SAC homepage, view and modify your account settings. If you're new to SAC, you should receive an email welcoming you to your tenant. There will be a link there to activate your account. Once you click onto that link to activate your account, it'll open up a web browser and take you to a page where you're gonna complete your account details and set your password. Once you're logged into your SAC tenant, the first thing that you're gonna see on the screen is your SAC homepage. One of the first things I'd recommend doing is favoriting the website so it's easy for you to get back to. Your SAC homepage can be customized. You can change what widgets are visible here. You might also notice at the top of your homepage that there are a couple different tabs. The Today tab is your homepage. Catalog tab is a way for sharing to occur with an SAC. We have more information about that in a different training session. Favorites would be any files or models in SAC that you've marked as a favorite. And shared with me is any file or model or really anything in SAC that has been shared with you will be visible from this screen. If you'd like to modify your homepage or access your profile, you're going to do so by going to the upper right hand corner where you're going to see the initials of your account. When you click onto that, you will see a link there for your profile settings and a link there for your home screen settings. Let's start out with profile settings. Once you're inside your profile settings, you'll see a quick overview of your profile and information. You can then click the link that says edit profile and change password, which will open up a new tab in your web browser. You see a number of different settings and options here. This depends on your SAC tenant and also your administration. If you'd like to change your password, you can click change right inside of the password group and quickly and easily change your password from there. Going back to SAC, if you'd like to customize your homepage, again, you'll click the button in the upper right hand corner, and then you're gonna click onto home screen settings. Inside of home screen settings, there are a number of different preferences and options that you can explore on your own. To point out a couple things here, the default tab is just what tab of the homepage appears when you first log in. Background, there are a couple different background themes that you can test out and find one that you like. The SAP logo is the logo that's at the bottom of the homepage. Uh, there's really no need to change that, but I suppose you have an option to do so if you decide you want to. And then below that are your home screen tiles. You'll notice that there are a series of tiles that are already activated for you. You can toggle on and off different tiles to test them out until you find the right fit for your SAC homepage. Thanks for joining me in this lesson on accessing SAC.